Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a ring reveal from Fragrant Jewels. This is their brand new Moonchild bath bomb, and I think it's really pretty. It's a dark navy blue with a gold shimmery moon on top. And as soon as I put this in the water, I knew it was gonna be really pigmented. I love this color of blue. It also has some shades of pink and purple coming out. And the first few minutes of it being in the tub, the pigment's going straight to the bottom and then it's gonna kinda fan out and come underneath the water. And it looks like a storm. I thought it looked really, really cool. And it does have some very interesting fragrance notes, I think. First of all, there's only three. I think that's cool. Because a lot of times they put so many that the smells kinda get lost. Um, but the three fragrance notes are peony, I say that different every time I say it. Peony, peony. <laughs> I love, those are my favorite kind of flowers, but for whatever reason, I have the hardest time pronouncing that. Um, it also has lavender and spice. So a very new scent. Um, a lot of their bath bombs for once you've been reviewing as many as I have, some of them I call recycled scents, where I'm like, oh, I can't really remember, but I know they used these fragrance notes before. Well, this one was very unique. I can tell you that. I can't really say for sure it smelled like peonies or lavender, but the combination of those scents was definitely a new fragrance, and I kind of liked it. It was a little masculine, um, and it was kind of a light fragrance, so it wasn't very overpowering or in your face. And I like that. I don't always want something that's overly fragranted. But this was definitely interesting to watch in the tub, and it lasted a very, very long time. Um, I tried not to touch it, but it did flip over when I was moving it um, to the middle of the screen. And a lot of times it'll dissolve at the bottom. So I'll go to like pick it up and the ring just like falls out. But when I went to test this after many, many, many minutes in the tub, it was just still solid. It would have lasted forever. So I try to be as patient as I can, but sometimes I just, I break and I, I crumble. So you'll see that here in a few minutes. But I did notice the very core of it has a lot of that purple pinkish pigment. So... You could kind of see it coming off now, but it was more concentrated right around the core of it. So here I went to kind of test it and then yeah, it still had some on it. So could not see the ring container. So I returned it back to the tub and then it did stain my hand a little just cause I kept touching it. Uh, but once I washed my hands, it came off and I didn't actually get in the bath with this one. I let the kids use it and it didn't stain their skin, which I was a little concerned about because when I'm telling you the water was extremely dark blue, it was extremely dark. It was very pigmented, but the kids did not get any kind of staining on them and it did not stain my tub. My tub, the, the gloss is kind of coming off of it. So in certain areas, pigment will stick to it, but this one didn't, didn't seem to bother it. So that's good. And then it rocked back and forth, and then eventually it just went back to kind of hanging out there and slowly dissolving. So that's when I decided to crumble it. And look at that water. It's so pretty. And it's really satisfying to crumble the last part of the bath bomb. It makes it all foamy again in the water. And dropped it. Been a while since I've dropped the container, so did that for you. <laughs> and very excited about the ring I got. So I think all the rings for this collection are really pretty. There's 10 different ones to collect. They have a blue shade stone. And this one was a very pale blue, almost like a bluish gray. And I like that. And of course it didn't connect. Um, and that's, I really like that. Unfortunately, my nails, whenever I wear like a holographic nail color, it's hard to focus on the ring. So I had to hold it kind of awkwardly. Um, so I apologize for that, but the beautiful ring, love it. Did a praise for $25 with 25 reward points, which is the norm. And also got the candle. So tomorrow or Wednesday, 
Um, I will be posting that so you can see what I got in that product. And I did order all their new stuff that they've been putting out. So stay tuned. Thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys.